Your Majesty! Oh, this must be your newly discovered daughter. What's she glaring at me for? Pardon me. Urchin just arrived with a strange news. I knew I knew you'd want to hear it right away. Indeed, Moray. You always know what's best. I've had excellent training training at the side of the most wonderful queen in history. I roll. I roll. A dead dragon has been found only a few islands away. Ooh. Oh, how sad. What happened to him? Her. And we don't know. We don't know yet. But the strange part is, is that it's not a sea wing. It's a sky wing. What? This close to the palace? Get Shark and take me to the body. Now! I hope my friends are all right. I'll check on them when we get back. I won't be gone long. They'll be safe here. Whoa, the currents are really strong. Kind of hard to swim. But as soon as we surface... Wait. They're not... They're not flying to the body. They're swimming. Right. That makes sense. They're sea wings. All right. I can do this. Swimming montage. <laughs> They're angling their wings to catch the currents. I should try that. This is great, but also exhausting. My wings are so tired. Hey, is that? Riptide. Hi. Oh my god, focus, you stupid camera. Focus. Okay, thank you. I bet he's not supposed to be following us. But I kind of like that he's he that he's there, close by. I guess I won't tell Coral on him. At least, not until I decide how mad I am about him keeping secrets from me. At last! I'm so tired. How am I going to get back to the Summer Palace? Ugh. Deal with that later. <sighs> She's been dead for a day or two. Killed quite violently. The first question, of course, is what a Skyling is doing this close to the palace. That's... that's... That's Kestrel! I have to tell her it's Kestrel. I should have told her back on the island. Mother needs to know, but... But... What if she thinks we killed her? Of course she'll think we killed her. The Dragons of Destiny arrive in the Summer Palace at, the, at exactly the same time as a dead Skywing. What kind of dragon are you? Can you be trusted? Who else would you attack? Exactly the way my friends have been looking at me. I can't tell her. Who did this to Kestrel? These are my chambers. Wait for me inside while I take care of this. <sighs> I don't know what to do. My friends have been in that cave all day. With guards, with guards posted outside. I really should go tell them about Kestrel, but... What will they think when they hear about her? They could decide... They could decide it's not safe here. Starflight could talk them into leaving. I can't leave yet. I'll ask Mother to, to have a feast tomorrow. That'll cheer them up. Yes, that's a better plan. Avoid them until tomorrow. Then tell them everything. Shh. Flash. Clever. I hope she doesn't wake up. 
Oh, I'm so glad you're here. Oh my gosh, I didn't put the voice in. Just pretend I said that with a high-pitched voice. Please don't be mad at me. A -a -a. Really? But aren't we rivals? Don't I threaten her chance at the throne? Maybe she'll be less crazy now that she has you. I need to get out of this harness, Tsunami. Tsunami, you have no idea how awful my life has been. Your life has been awful? Try being raised with no ocean by dragons who hate you and treat you like a tadpole. I'm treated like a tadpole. You're only, what, one year old? I'm sure that'll change. Well, mostly sure. Halfway sure. At least you have friends. Well, I was sort of stuck with those four, and they're always arguing with me or getting mad about something. They seem great. I always wanted brothers and sisters. You don't have brothers? Lots, but mother thinks they play too rough. I'm not, I'm not allowed to play with anyone. Mother's obsessed, mo mother's obsessed with finding out who's killing her daughters. She, sub she suspects almost everyone, except Mori, who's perfect and boring. I guess my friends are all right when, when they're not complaining. They complain a lot, though. I complained once. Mother nearly got me got me a muzzle to match the harness. At least somebody loves you. She loves you too. Oh, I hope you take Whirlpool. I was so sure I'd have to, I'd have to marry him. But now you can. No way. No, no, no. First of all, I don't have time to get married. I have to stop the war and save the world. Second of all, I'd rather have my tail nibbled off by snapping turtles. <laughs> That's so funny. He's dreadful, isn't he? <laughs> Your smaller majesties. Anyway. Oof, wrong voice. <laughs>